Hi, little mates. Um, sorry I didn't do that on the last video. If you've seen that by now, um. Okay, so um, I'm going to give up my top five scary horror horror games. Basically, why did I say scary? Um. <sighs> And Five Nights at Freddy's is probably not going to be in this one because that is not scary to me. It's fun to me, but it's not scary to me. So, um... Well, the first one would, um, definitely be, um... Well, I think this is only in... Well, I don't... The first one of me would probably be <laughs> the fifth one would would probably be the forest for me, considering that that is um probably a very um I've seen videos on it and I haven't played it yet. It's a game where cannibals try to get you after you playing craft in the forest. Um, yes, I think you can get an end to the game. Um, but it's very scary when they go up and hit you. And um, if you play this game and don't get scared by it, please don't get all angry and start calling me an idiot for... Um, Thinking it's scary. Um, I do think it's scary. Um, my next one would probably be um. Actually, I may put Five Nights at Freddy's in this, but next one would probably be Five Nights at Freddy's one, but only at the first one you try to play it because um. Then the jump scares can really get you. So, um, then of course, Five Nights at Freddy's, um, three, because that is a little scary, but not that scary. And Five Nights at Freddy's two, and, um, that is not that scary, um, and Five Nights at Freddy's. For, of course, because that is scary when you first start playing it. All of them are kind of scary when you first start playing it. Um, but then when you get into it, it's not that scary. So did I give off five? That's four right now. And then five. We'll go ahead and try ten. My next one will probably be Never Ending Nightmares. Because that one would probably be... um. That one, um, was probably not that scary in the game, but, um, scary to the people who were playing the game. I haven't played the game yet, but I think that would probably be, um, one of the scariest games, um, Never Ending Nightmares. Sorry. Um, and then the next one would probably be the next one you're probably going to say this one wasn't isn't going to be that scary but radiation island when the zombies come up to you and they just flop around it's scary and the crocodile tried to eat me and that was scary that was very scary so yeah radiation island is kind of scary <laughs> um Cause when I got killed by the crocodile, it was scary. And when the zombie came up to me, I was like, "What the heck is that? Wow! 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 Get away from me!" And um, what was my next one? Be? Friday the 13th, a very, um, old, old, um, horror game, um, 
But when um Jason Voorhees um or Voorhees I don't know um pops up at you, it is kind of scary. Or at least I've heard, and um so I think I might have even saw it, and it's kind of scary. Um, I think so. Um, yeah. Um, if you um do happen to um know about that one then uh that would be a great one to just um if you're a youtuber play on youtube um that would be good um you don't have to i don't, I don't know why i said that just uh, um now um Give off some that are that scary. I can't really think of that many that I play. Um, yeah, I think that should be it for the young. Um, oh, no. <clears throat> what would be my next one? Scratch that I had any of the finance of Freddy's. So. That brings her four. So I still have one, two, three, four. So I have still more to fill in. So um, now the first one will be Five Nights at Freddy's 3 because um, Five Nights at Freddy's 3 has a very scary atmosphere. And even though Spring Trap's jump scare is um, pretty much crap, um, uh, some of the other jump scares are um scary and um you kind of don't want to get jump scared by them so uh yeah mm. I do recommend playing this game um if um you think you are um okay with it and my next one would probably be five nights at freddy's 2 considering that one is not that scary um but still um when you stop playing it it can you know, jump you a little um my next one would probably be five nights at freddy's 1 Considering that that's um, not that scary, but it's got it's got when you first start playing all the games, they scare you at first. Um, and my next one would probably be um my next one would probably be Seven Nights at um, Buddy's 3D. I know this isn't really, I guess this is a family game. Um. But it is scary when he jump scares you. He screams. He opens like his mouth and he screams at you. And it's a very cool game. And um, I think there's a light version. I don't think that's the demo. But um, yeah, it's all right. Does that just mean it doesn't have ads? Probably with that. Okay, so, um, now, um, for it, this one, this one would probably be, um, not that scary to any of you. And it, it really, I guess I shouldn't put the one I'm about to put, um, I should put, I should put Five Nights, or uh, what's it called? I forgot what it's called, Seven Nights at Mines or something. The one with Freddy, and it's like Minecraft pixelated. It's like Minecraft, but, um, it, um, when, the same thing, when he comes in your office, he, um, screams in your face, and now, for number one. Five Nights at Freddy's 4. So, uh, this game, 
like I said, with the other ones, um, it scares you at first, but then you get used to it. Um, I know there was a Halloween update that just released, so um, I might play that pretty soon. I'm probably going to. I said I was going to. So, um, why not do it? Um, well, yep, yeah, that was it. That was ten, right? I think that was ten. That was it for my top ten horror games. It was really hard to decide. Um. As always, thumbs up, subscribe.